سبحان الله عما يشركون And Imam Malik was so revered that the official announcement would be in the time of Hajj. That la yufti, because think about it, thousands of people flocking to Medina. And the official announcement comes, although today there isn't an official announcement, but nobody, la yufti nas ahad. Nobody can give fatwa. Official statement. وَمَالِكُمْ بِالْمَدِينَةِ Whilst Malik is in Medina. That is the official. I mean, look at the, this legend. Let's take a look at him, a bit about his life. He then goes on and he studies with Ibn Shihab and he has this amazing memory. And what's interesting is, he's sitting with Rabi'ah and Rabi'ah brings him. And you know, there's that thing, See, it's the way the world works, doesn't it, almost? Like you, you know people through people. And I suppose Rabia was Rabia, so he has his name anyway. And he brings this young kid around with him, Malik, this young little kid. So nobody's going to take a kid seriously, just as Ibn Shahab doesn't take him seriously. And, and he tells the lesson, he narrates these hadith, he's saying them, probably 40, maybe 50, he narrates them. Next day, they turn up again. So Ibn Shahab is like, what the hell am I just wasting my time here? So what is this? I'll tell you what, tell me what I taught you yesterday and then I'll move on. So he says, I, I can see that you know you haven't bought a pad or anything with you. So tell me what I said yesterday. So Rabi'ah just looks at Malik, who's a kid at the time, and says, go on. And Malik starts to transmit them one by one. Photographic memory, people. Better than if you watch Suits, the guy has. So the thing is, this, and Ibn Shihab al-Zuhri is impressed. And you know what he says to him? He says, Ma kuntu adun. He says, I never used to think that there was anyone, baqiya kahada ghayri, that there was anybody that could do this except me. And what's interesting is he almost sees himself in this young person. Is that, just, is that like me? Thereby taking a greater interest in him. Kind of forming what would become this great Imam who would, has and continues to influence our take, not only our understanding of Islam, but Islamic law today throughout the globe.